Hi everyone, my name is Thomas Kim. Today is February 19th, 2020. This is my 27th episode about 3D graphics Intel TVB OpenCL Vulkan using Microsoft Visual C++. In this episode, we will learn how to create Lambda Generator and how to use Reverse Iterator. In my previous episode, episode 26, we learned how to rotate container elements using make rotator. My current session continues from my previous video, episode 26. If you haven't watched my previous episode, please watch this video. Otherwise, you may not understand my current session. Please note that I updated the C++ library extensions. Please double click this link and download updated C++ library extensions. Also, double click this link. By watching this video, please update CPP library extensions. Without further ado, let's get started. Start Visual Studio Code. Open your working folder. Click empty space. Click this button, 27 Lambda Generator. Hit enter, click this button, lambda.cpp, hit enter, control V, include, talk play button, output hpp, talk play button, s stream, stream, auto, and there, talk play button, and there, void, test, reverse, iterator int main copy the function name paste it here control shift p edit configuration json control s control w then the squiggle goes away using container t std vector int so we defined a container class t std vector int container t b 0 1 2 3 4 0 5 stream original vector b and there now start command prompt dir cd 27 lambda generator dir cl ehsc std c plus plus 17 Lambda dot cpp fe m dot exe hit enter cls m. You should be able to build successfully. From this vector, we will find zero from the end of this vector. There is two zero. The first element is zero and the element before the last element is zero. We will find this zero from this vector and we will remove this zero like this auto reverse itr std find b r begin b r end we find zero we print out the type of rev itr like this stream type of rev itr talk play fun get type category rev itr and there now if rev itr is not equal to b we should say r end then we found reverse iterator for this element stream we found element rev itr and there now we remove B erase rev itr. Now we build. We build again. It does not build because this erase member go to definition. It takes iterator type. But this is reverse iterator. I will disable it. If we build again clsm the type of REV ITR, its type is reverse iterator. 
from this reverse iterator or ITR we create iterator container t iterator rev itr base okay this is actually incorrect we will fix this issue shortly now we erase v erase itr stream after erase v and there now we build again cls m we found element zero and we erased the iterator the element but five is deleted so there is a problem in this calculation we have to do minus one okay now we build again cls now we found zero before the last element from this vector and we removed the element using this method then we successfully removed zero from this container so you have to remember this formula from reverse iterator to iterator we have to use reverse iterator base minus one is equal to iterator this relationship between reverse iterator and iterator is very important so please remember this relationship so i created a function we can do like this talk play fun reverse iterator to iterator we can simplify like this okay if we build again cls the result is the same also we can fix this part like this i will copy and paste it here we can use std make reverse iterator v begin std make reverse iterator v end okay please note that it does not work it does not work let's build once again it built but it does not work properly we have to swap the order i will disable this part this is wrong i will copy and paste it should be end okay we have to swap the order and it should be begin okay now let's build once again cls m it works perfectly so when we use make reverse iterator we have to be careful please keep this point in mind when we use reverse iterator we have to swap end and begin as well don't forget this point now i will create another function scroll down void test reverse rotation i will copy this function paste it here i will disable it using container t std vector int container t v 0 1 2 3 4 0 5 stream original vector v and there now we build again cls m from this original vector we rotate left we will find one like this or itr std find v begin v end one if itr is not equal v end then std rotate v begin itr v end 
string after rotation d and l now we build again cls m so this vector is rotated left so element 1 is moved to first place element 2 is moved to the second place now we want to rotate in reverse order we will find the last element 0 I will copy this function again copy paste I say test left rotation okay I will copy this function name paste it here and disable it this is reverse rotation I will delete this part auto rev itr std find vr begin vr end we find zero okay because we used r begin and r end we are finding this zero the element before the last element okay then we rotate if rev itr is not v r end we have to test with r end then std rotate v r begin we provide rev itr v r end now we call this function from here we rebuild cls m we haven't displayed stream after rotation b and l we build again cls m so from this vector we found zero using reverse find using this iterator we rotate to the right so zero becomes the last element four becomes the element before the last element we rotated to the right we rotated b to the right and made rev itr the last element now scroll up in this case we find value 1 we rotated b to left and made itr itr is iterator for element 1 the first element scroll down i will enable it stream and there we will rebuild cls m in left rotation we found one and left rotated one place we made one itr the first element in this case we found zero using reverse find and we rotated to the right we found this element and rotated to the right and made it the last element now we will create lambda generator called make rotator like this emum direction t left right i will make it emum class template direction t direction type name container type i will give it default value direction t left also here std vector int type name container t talk play fun remove constant reference t container type type name iterator type type name container t iterator type type name reverse iterator type container t 
reverse iterator type or a make rotator container type we define the container type here cntr now here if context peer direction this direction is defined here is direction t left else this is left rotation this is right rotation now or rotator this is lambda okay iterator type iterator type is defined here begin or offset iterator type end here i will define using offset t talk play fun remove constant reference t decl type offset if context peer talk play fun types is integral type offset t else if context peer std is same b reverse iterator type offset t else now this is offset this type using DIFFT DIFFT means difference type type name iterator type difference type or offset to begin begin is the argument std advance begin DIFFT offset now return std rotate begin offset for end please note that offset pause is an iterator now if this offset type is reverse iterator type then return std rotate begin please note that this offset is reverse iterator then we have to convert to iterator like this offset base minus one and i explained this here okay i applied this rule now offset t is of iterator type then return std rotate begin offset end now we created a rotator for left rotation now here return rotator now i copy this part copy paste it it here now we have to make right rotation now in case of right rotation it should be reverse iterator type difference type and this offset should be end and it should be sorry i made a mistake here it should be here i made a mistake here now scroll down it should be here now we have to make it reverse iterator reverse iterator type please note that we have to swap the order and reverse iterator type begin about this point i explained here when we convert iterator to reverse iterator we also have to swap end with begin in the same manner when we convert iterator this type is iterator type we also have to swap end and begin now in this case i will copy this part paste it here now 
This is offset because offset is already reverse iterator. I will copy this part and paste it. In this case, offset is iterator type. So, reverse iterator type. We have to fix like this. Sorry, don't put a semicolon here. I made mistake. Scroll up. Also semicolon here. I also made a mistake here. It should be reverse iterator type. We should do this. Now let's test it. Void test make rotator. STD using container T STD vector int container T B 0 1 2 3 4 0 5 stream original vector B and L or ITR to std find v begin v end to find element with a value to from the beginning of the container or rotate left make rotator we provide container type rotate left v begin itr2 v end i will copy the function name paste it here i will disable it control k control c we build again make rotator no matching overload function found Sorry, we have to fix this part, also this part. Now we rebuild 99, I missed N here, scroll down, also N here. Now we rebuild CLS. I have to remove one return here. We rebuild. Okay. Stream after left rotation. B and there. We build again. CLS M. This is original vector. We found iterator for element 2 here. We create left rotator using make rotator. Then we rotate. Then the third element with value 2 becomes the first element. Now we create another rotator or rotate right make rotator direction T right. B rotate right b begin we use offset 3 b end stream after right rotation b end there now we build again cls m i think we rotate it too much 1 2 we have to rotate 2 2 CLS M if we rotate this vector to the right two place 1 2 then 5 becomes the last element so it works successfully now from this vector we want to find the second zero this is first zero this is last zero. We want to find this element. So, or REV 
itr0 std find v begin v end 0 we have to use reverse find we rotate right v begin please note that we have to provide iterator begin not r begin then rev itr0 this is reverse iterator v end stream after right rotation with reverse iterator rev itr0 v and there we build again cls now we made last zero the last element or rotate right v begin rev itr zero plus one v end i will copy this faced with plus one now we build again cls m now we found zero and we rotated right then we made it the first element with rev itr zero plus one with this bring last zero to the front of the vector in this case bring last zero to the back of the vector we will use this algorithm in my next episode to implement in place quick sort please note that i updated c++ library extension please double click this link to download updated c++ library extension and by watching this video you have to update c++ library extension I will upload the complete source code to my website. By the time you watch this video, you can double click this link and download the complete source code. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you for watching.